Hello everybody, my name is Little Uni. I did that intro holding scissors and I'm gonna kill somebody. Today, we are going to be opening up um, these Animal Jam surprise bags and then we're gonna be going online and seeing what each of the codes do because apparently with like the purchase of each of these little things, all of them come with a code and I'm not sure if they're like each gonna give you the same thing or what. But I have six different things here. I have three of these little um, bags, <laughs> which are actually apparently plushies. As you can see, it's like a clip plushie. On the back, you can see that it's like um, things that you would attach to your backpack or your keys. <laughs> I don't know. And I actually didn't realize that these were um, plushies until I actually like looked at them a few minutes before recording um, and we also have three of these little cupcake things which I think are like the best these are not plushies I'm guessing those would be crazy tiny plushies sorry about the lighting in here this is my recording closet I don't know if anyone's I don't know if anyone has ever seen it before but these are neat, so we're gonna be doing these in a pattern. Plushy, then toy, and then, yeah, it goes on. So I've never opened a surprise bag before. I've got these scissors here, which we're gonna be starting with opening the plushy bag that I just showed you guys. Let's move it so that we don't cut someone's ear off or something. Let's see what it is. Whoa, well, well, there goes our code. Oh, it's the kitty! You get this little kitty! Do 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 do! Whipping my hair back and forth. Oh, he's all purple and stuff. He's very soft and he's very firm too. You can't squish him, but he's very soft. His tail is weird. It's like 2D. Um, but that's super exciting. Look at that. His tag is made of cloth. It's not really cloth, it just kind of feels like cloth. Okay, I dropped our code down here. Did you know Palace's cats have the longest and thickest hair of any cat species? Kitty Titan P14? What does that mean? So here we've got this little... Is that his name? Do they all say Kitty Titan? It really does not want to focus. <laughs> but it says like right here kitty titan p14 i don't know if maybe that's like a name i don't know but i guess all of the things on the back of these bags are like the different options there are only six of the stuffed animals so if we're lucky we are going to um be able to find three different ones but i have a feeling we're gonna hit a double because, oh yeah, okay, so those are their names. So on the back, like they're all labeled, like this is their name. So I think P1, it's probably standing for Plushy Series 1. This is Series 1. I don't know if there are other series available, but whatever. So now we're going to move on to a cupcake, which I am so excited about. This is what we really need the scissors for, because these are very tightly packed. They really did not want people to steal this stuff. I don't blame them. Oh, that's cute. It has like little sprinkle details. I didn't notice that. These are actually weirdly more detailed than I thought they were. So each of these are made out of plastic, so if you get them yourself, you will actually have a safe place to put your toy, because I have a feeling it's going to be really tiny. Um, let me pan this down. This is a little better. You guys don't need to see the ceiling. So you can see that there are little, like, sprinkle details. They're not colored, which has always bothered me with toys. And it's a twist open. Oh, it's sort of a twist open. <laughs> it's not really a twist open. Okay. Wow, it's like a mouse. Sorry, I looked before showing you guys. Wow, these are way over packaged. Inside this plastic thing is another bag. So inside we've got our code and our little pamphlet. I hate that all of these come with pamphlets. I feel like there should be a special pamphlet pet or something so that you're not drowning in these. 
but this is our little guy. He's so cute. The camera still won't focus because it's trying to look at my face. There we go. He's got glitter on his ear insides. He's a, just a little blue mouse guy. I don't know if he's uh, a mouse or a gerbil. We've also got this weird tiny, tiny. So if I were you guys, I would keep at least like two of these things to keep your stuff because this is tiny. That would be awesome if I just dropped it. It still really won't focus, but it's like, it's not a carrot. It's sort of, I don't know what this is. It's just this little cup of greens. I don't know, but it is so small. So I'm going to put that right back in there. What do we say about this guy? He's Jelly Mouse 373. Mice can use their whiskers to sense temperature changes, woo, because no one else can do that. So he does have a star, so I'm wondering if he's rare. I really don't know. So let's just stick him back in his cupcake, and we'll set him up here with his kitty friend. So next is another plushie. Now there's no visual, like, bag difference between all of these plushies, so I didn't really organize them. Oh my god, I didn't check for... I didn't check to make sure that whatever this toy is was going to be in the way and I almost literally like cut off a body part. So let's see. What's this guy? Looks blue. Come out. Be born. Ah, it's a pig. Oink. Wow, he's like bigger than the cat. I like him better because he's bigger. He's more round. I like it a lot. He's so cute though. Oink, oink. This is good cake. P15. So, he's so cute. Out of the plushies, he's my favorite. I actually just remembered that I never looked at this pamphlet. Let's see, it's just an adoption. Okay, so the star that our little um, animal came with means that it's like almost rare, I guess. Oh my god, what is this list right now? And there's another side. Does this fold out anymore? No, it doesn't. There are so many of them. There's rare. Uh, I'm gonna try to see if I could get this to work, but not really. So there's rare, gem, diamond, and ultra rare. So the one that we got was a gem, which I'm not sure is the least rare. Okay, so it's not. It's like the second rarest, I guess. That's weird. It's not weird, but I'm just looking at this crazy long list. How did they come up with so many things? I guess there's a phantom. Oh, it's a limited edition pet thing. Okay, well, I guess that's good to know. And now I'm going to have 40,000 of these pamphlets. <laughs> okay, so next we're going to do another cupcake. This one is pink and blue. I did organize the cupcakes in order of how badly I would want to eat them. Um, the other one had white frosting and a pink cake thing. <laughs> so, yeah, they all have like the same mold and stuff, but they are different colors. At the store there was also like blue frosting and I think another color, but I only got three, so. Yeah, just like the same base thing. Maybe there's a different yeah, no, they all have a ladybug on their door. Um, I really wish my camera would focus, but it really does not want to. So let's see, this twi like twist off, but then they stop and you have to pull. It's weird. Maybe that's like dumb person proof. Um, <laughs> so it's really hard to like, because you have to cut these guys out of the plastic. It's hard to like not look. I think we've got a cricket. He's a butterfly. <gasps> wow. Oh, look at him. He's like so tiny, the camera doesn't want to focus on him. He's not like a butterfly actually. Oh, is this like the upper half of a praying mantis for some reason? That's weird. He's foggy in the camera. Um, let's see, how rare is this guy? He's not rare at all. He doesn't even get a picture. This is Miss Sprinkles 328. Okay. So this guy also comes with a little thing. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a cup of hot cocoa. So, oh my, I can't, I don't know how to hold this to show you guys. Let me hold it by the little thing. It's this little tiny cup of hot cocoa. 
You see? Do you see the resemblance? It's so tiny. Everybody get back in your cupcake. And we again, we just get like the same pamphlet, so I'm not even gonna bother. Now we're running out of space on our display shelf. There's so much garbage in here, oh my God. So this is our last plushie. Let's see, can I feel it to try to guess? Ooh, this one's firm. This one's got a lot of bits going on. Let's see, can I guess which one it is? Um, I'm guessing that this is gonna be the bunny. So let's open it up and see. Oh, again, I didn't do the check to make sure it wasn't gonna cut off any limbs. Okay. Whoa! It's a unicorn! I got the mystery pet, you guys! It's not a unicorn, sorry. I saw the rainbow mane and I, and I automatically assumed unicorn. It's not a unicorn, it's a pony. On the back, they list like all the different pets and then a mystery pet. That's cool, I got the mystery pet, you guys. I'm happy, wow. So let's see, what's your name, mystery pet? Taper Pony. Wow. A group of ponies is called a string? I didn't know that. I'm learning, Animal Jam. Thank you. Oh my gosh, this one is now my favorite plushie. He's so neat. I love him. So we're going to put him actually right under the camera because I'm running out of space. All right. So now it's time for our last cupcake. This one is purple, look, you can't see. This one is purple with a white base. Um, I chose this one as the most edible because I would love to eat purple frosting. Hello, who wouldn't? That didn't cut anything. So I wonder if this one will be rare as well. We'll finish on like a couple rare notes or like ultra rare, I don't know. Exterior is the same. These are very easy to unscrew, by the way. I feel like if you were like in the store, then you would easily be able to steal these even though they are overpackaged. Oh my God, I'm trying not to look at the toy. I saw something that kind of looked like a mushroom. I think it might be a ladybug. Or maybe it's just a pet mushroom, I don't know. I don't know what you get out of these codes either. I don't know if it's like the pet that you got or den items or what? Whoa. Okay, so he came out. I think he's a firefly. Hold on. It really doesn't want to focus on these tiny ones. <laughs> but it's like a firefly with this purple glowy bit. And of course the head and he's got yellow wings. That's neat. And he's also got a hole for wearing stuff. Okay, let's see what his accessory is. It looks like a sword to me. I don't think they would do that though. Oh, I see. It's a little candle. It's a candle on a cup, the way they do. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to do close-ups of this stuff later or something so that you guys can see. That's really neat. Oh, I didn't look at his thing. How rare is he? That's all that really matters. Oh, uh, he's sort of rare. He's got a clover and not a star. Um, so this is Jelly Wisp. We got two jellies today, you guys. I kind of want him to be my favorite because he came in the best cupcake, but I kind of, whoa! <laughs> but he's kind of not my favorite. What is this? Oh, that's part of my microphone stand. Very professional person here. Okay. So let's set that up on the Hall of Fame. So out of all of these ones, I think the horse was my favorite. Not because he was the mystery, but because not only was it really surprising to see him, but it was also kind of like, I love his mane and his coloring in general. Out of the toys, I honestly don't really remember which one is which. I feel like it's a tie between the mouse and the praying mantis. Um, the other guy, meh. Not my favorite, but I do love them all very much. So now, let's move on to the online portion of this video and see what all of these codes do. Alrighty, so now we are online. Uh, we're gonna see, oh yes, this is not related to the stuff that I got um, 
that I got just now. I was playing Play Wild and I redeemed a whole bunch of not toy related codes. So we're gonna enter in our codes uh, starting from the cat to the firefly. All right, now we're, this has been the day of gifts, wow. So let's enter a code. Plush Kitty is what we're starting with. Ah, it worked. Okay, whoops. I'm not gonna be censoring these codes because they're a one-time use thing. So if I were you, I wouldn't even bother trying these codes because now that they're used, they're not going to work in your game. Oh, I got a diamond. Strew Apple has gifts waiting in Animal Jam Play Wild. Oh, cool. So that was just like one diamond. <laughs> I got a toy in one diamond. Are they all gonna be like that? So, I can't record on Play Wild because it is... I don't know if you guys can even hear me when I'm over there, so I'm scared to talk. I can't record on Play Wild because it's an Apple product and they really don't like people like recording on their devices for some reason, so I can't figure it out quite yet without spending like a bunch of money. So now we're gonna do the mouse. These toys have scratch and redeem codes. Um, I'm not really sure why. I never liked scratching these things. I remember doing it once on like a scratch ticket. Uh, and I guess that was kind of fun, but I don't like doing it now. Although I guess at the time I was of age when I would normally be playing Animal Jam, so maybe Animal Jam players like this. Not that I'm not an Animal Jam player. But I guess the target audience would like that for Animal Jam. Every time I use one of these scratch things, oh, I lost internet. Every time I use one of these scratch things, I'm always like really scared that I scratched off not enough and it's gonna deny me because I used only some of the code and not all of it. That's legitimately happened to me before. Dang it, we have to enter the code again because I lost internet. Let's re-enter that code, shall we? All right, here's our gift. 2,000 gems. Thoinks. Oh, you unlocked your first sticker for your Adopt-A-Pet checklist. Hello. Collect more stickers to unlock prizes. View your sticker now. All right, I'm pumped. I can go with this. Wow. Okay, so with every five, you get a new gift. Oh, look at all these things. Where's my new sticker? Gotta give me some guidance here because I have no idea. All right, it's not a series one. Oh, I, it'll say, this is a series three. Here he is, Jelly Mouse. That's cool, all right. Jelly Mouse has been added to our Adopt-A-Pet checklist. We don't have five of those pets, so I'll kind of like not be able to see what each of the milestone gifts are, but that's fine, I guess. Next is the pig that we got from earlier. I don't remember his name. Good Cake is our pig's name. He is a good cake. These people have naming skills that are on the same level as mine. Alrighty, here's our gift. A diamond. The strew apples probably got a sapphire waiting. I am strew apple. Play wild strew apple probably has a sapphire. Next is our praying mantis pal. Um, I don't remember his name as well. I'm not really gonna bother to try to memorize them all. He is just the praying mantis pal. There's no way he could be anything else. Oh, this is another scratch and redeem one. I kinda hate these. They leave dust all over the floor. I think that's a sign that I'm too old for these. <laughs> that's how you know you're too old for online games. You don't wanna use the scratch and redeem things because they'll leave dust on the floor and you'll have to sweep it up later. I lost internet again. <sighs> oh, my gift went through. It's 500 gems for the not really rare at all ones. I had no idea that it actually went through that way. Whoa. 
<laughs> I didn't mean to click on that person, sorry. I accidentally moved the camera, so I'm gonna hope this is close enough to what we had before. Next is our mystery pet. I'm really excited to see what this um, code could be. It's probably something kind of like not bad. Okay, what do you guys think? Is it gonna be gems, diamonds, or an item? Hmm. I think it might be like two diamonds. Three diamonds! I was so close! Okay, Stu Apple probably has the same thing waiting. All right, we're on to our last pet. Last and sort of least, we have our Firefly friend. That's a good name. So we've got our, our Praying Mantis pal, our Firefly friend, and some other name for the first guy. Alrighty, let's see what our Firefly friend gives us. 1,000 gems. Alrighty, those were all of our toys, you guys. That was every single one of them. So this was fun. This was really fun. I hope we can do this again later. Maybe not with the plushies because we have literally half of them. Or was it? I know there's some amount. <laughs> but we have pretty much all of them. We've got the mystery pet, which I think is supposed to be the goal. Um... But I would totally be doing the cupcake thing again if you guys are interested in that. Um, I won't be able to do it super often because they're a little bit expensive. But I would definitely love to do it again if you guys enjoyed this. I'm not playing Animal Jam anymore. I don't need my headphones. <laughs> I hope you guys really enjoyed this because I had a good time. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Maybe give me naming ideas for my uh, plushies or come up with an idea for our mouse friend because I can't think of a word that means friend that starts with an M so I'm not sure what to call him. I hope you all really enjoyed this video because I did. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I hope to see you in the comments in one of my videos. Bye bye